Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're wondering, why are you sitting on the floor in your kitchen? Well, it is because I am getting down to the level of my cats and I wanted to try the Flippity Fish toy on Oreo and Feisty. Um, if you watched my, it's called the Flippity Flippity Fish Cat Toy. If you watch my Dollar General haul, um, you will see I bought two of them, one for Oreo, one for Feisty. And I charged up the uh, battery packs in them. I put the catnip inside the little white pouch it comes with. And um, basically you turn the switch on, you put the little catnip pouch over the battery pack the cats can smell the catnip and basically they will play with the fish they set off a sensor the fish flips and flops like a real fish and i just can't wait to see what um what my cats are going to do with this with this toy let's let's check it out <laughs> What is it doing, buddy? What is that silly fish doing? Get it, Oreo. Get it. Get that silly fish. Get that crazy fish, Oreo. Mama, feisty. Look, Mama, here. One for you. Feisty. Feisty girl. She's very cautious, so. Come here, Feisty. Oh, now Oreo's going after that one. Mama, get the one over there. They've never had a toy. Ooh, that was a real fish. It would be in trouble. Mama. She has to smell the catnip on it. Get that fish, Oreo. You get that silly fish. She's more interested in the string than the fish. Come on, Get it, baby girls. Get it, baby girls. Good girl. There, now she's not so cautious of it. It's like it's a toy, silly. They've never had a toy like that. So that's the first. It makes noise. And they're not used to the, the noise part. I'll tell you what. I am not disappointed no, with my cat's reaction with it. Because they have never had... Um, a toy like that yeah, that girl, makes that kind of, you know, mechanical sound. So, of course, it is hey, going to scare them. They've never had a toy like that at first. But smelling the catnip, and then, of course, on the fishing pole, which they both like them fishing pole, like mice with the feathers and everything, and the birds and all that. Um, they really enjoy that. So this is like a, a step up from that. They just are very, very cautious because of the sound that it actually um, makes. <laughs> She's trying to bite the cord. No, you can't bite the string, silly. Ooh, get it, girl. 
she got good reflexes. See, she's smelling the catnip now. <laughs> no, she just likes the core better than the fish. No, she's playing with the fish, but she wants to bite it off the cord. You can take it, unclip it. You can unclip it. Yeah, just unhook that from that little uh, uh -huh. There, see? Now he's not now he's not flapping and flipping. Now she's like puzzled. Hmm. There we go, two of them. Oreo was actually, uh, it was stuck under your chair. Oreo was like actually trying to sneak around and try to attack it from behind. I was laughing. Well, they know it's not a bird. So, see, the fact that it's fish, I think that puzzles... Oh, he's attacking his. Oh, he got that one in the hallway? Yeah, he pounced on it. Oh, cool. Let me see. Oh, good. Good, good, good. She's kind of looking at him like, what, am I, what are we doing with these? What are they? They're fishes, yeah. See, they... They're not sure, like, what they are because they were used to their, uh, birdies. So, a fish is something different. Oh, Oreo got his. He had it right on his nail, like, mm. Get that fishy, Oreo. Get that darn get fish. Get it, Oreo. Get it. Get it. Get it right by its neck. Grab that fish. Be like, you get over here, you fishy, you. She can look at us like... What is this? Um, yeah, but see, I think she might be a little stoned, too, because of the catnip. He's rubbing up on the magazine rack, and she was rubbing her face. Alrighty, guys. Well, I am not disappointed with my cat's reaction with this toy. Um, I mean, they've never seen fish before. I don't have an aquarium. I didn't get to go fishing at all this summer, so my cats really have never been around live, flipping, flopping fish. So, you know, it is understandable that that sound, you know, maybe scares them a little bit or they're uncertain of it. Um, but the fact that they did interact with it, even for just a few minutes, is definitely a good sign. I do think it's a really cute toy for cats, and um, as long as you keep, you know, it charged up with the USB charger, and uh, maybe make sure every few days you put some fresh catnip in, I think over time that becomes a really fun toy for your cats to just go to and activate it. I'm not really sure where the sensor in them fish are. I'm thinking it's somewhere in front, maybe by the head, somewhere by the eye. I'm not really 100% sure. But do I think that this toy definitely was worth, you know, $15 a piece for my guys? Yes, I do, because it's the holidays, and I just want them to have something different. Um, I definitely think they're going to be using it again. I'm going to turn, turn them off, put them away for now. And then each evening I'm going to like reintroduce them to them on the fishing poles and then off the poles. And I think once they just get used to that, that sound, um, I think they, you know, have a toy that, I mean, I can, um, you know, be sure that they're going to play with. You can take the battery pack out and you can actually wash the, um, the actual outer part of the fish. So... All in all, I think it's a pretty well-made toy, pretty durable. I think my guys are going to like it. They just have to get used to it. Like right now, 
Oreo actually went running down the hall after it and pounced on it. And it flipped and flopped for about 30 seconds or so and then stopped. Um, so yeah, definitely I give the Flippity Fish. I give it a big thumbs up. I am going to give it a 10 because I honestly think that cats are going to have a blast with it. Even if they seem a little unsure of it right away, I think over time it's definitely going to grow on my guys. And the fact that my guys are even doing anything with it at all is pretty cool. Because a lot of things just don't interest my cats. Um, so yeah, I would recommend it if you, you know, have a cat and are considering getting your guys one of these crazy toys. You can also get them online. I purchased mine from Dollar General. Um, but yeah, I definitely think it's a cool toy. And uh, as a matter of fact, I actually have to go on their website and they give you 20% off. Um, I think they make other cat toys too. So um, they give you, if you're doing a little survey about the Flippity Fish, 20% um, off to use on their website. So I'm going to do that and we'll see, like, you know, if they have anything interesting. So if you like this video, guys, please give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit my subscribe button. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please take care and stay safe. And um, I will see you all on my next one.